Oh, hey. I'm glad you could join me. Welcome back to Kato's Corners. I am Sun Coach Kato. We went on a field trip. We got the Dragon Crest Great Shield Talisman, Shard of Alexander, Rolana's Cameo, Great Jar's Arsenal so I can be the GOAT, and now... Oh, yeah. All 14 of the Fruit Punch Gatorade. And then for the, for the Flask, we got Flame Shrouding Crack Tier and Leading Hard Tier. Boost that fire, boost that poise. Let's begin. All right, here we go. Next attempts against the Putrescent Knight. I look so fancy when I come down. <clears throat> All right, there we go. Ugh. New episode of resetting the, uh, the, the fart bit. Oh, right off the bat, I am already able to soak just a bit more. All right, cool. Can't be com- Okay, there we go. Well, at least I'm catching it with some of the fire. Horsey attack. Horsey attack. There we go. Do, 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 do. Owies. You know what? I forgot to drink this. Oh, uh, he's going to do the fires. Fuck! This is so goddamn hard to, to track and dodge. I'm honestly not sure how to dodge that particular fire attack. There's just so... I, I'm sure I, I'm sure we all, a lot of us say, say this, our, like during our, our initial playthroughs and repeat, even some in repeat playthroughs, but doesn't it, some attacks just feel fucking cheap at times. Just, I'm just gonna cover the entire area and I'm not gonna make it obvious to know, like, where to dodge. It's just, you know, it feels, that type of attack kind of feels cheap. <laughs> Alright, here we go. You know what? Fuck it, we're popping this right away. Ooh! I wouldn't have been able to gotten away with that without the Dragon Crest. Okay. It's the multi-attack. Horsey. Horsey. All right, it's the bullshit attack. Bullshit attack. Oh, okay. Apparently it wasn't as hard to dodge, but it wasn't obvious where I needed to go either. Ow. Yeah. It was just, he got me in just the right rhythm of fuck you, fuck you, oh, and then fuck you. This, this boss battle is all about just straight up memorizing the goddamn attack patterns. More so than I think ever. Because his attack patterns are all over the place. It doesn't fit, uh, I don't know, it just, sometimes he delays, sometimes he's instant. It's, it's obnoxious. It's obnoxious. It's engaging, but it's also obnoxious. I just, I can't, it's hard to get a rhythm. You have to like get, you have to keep in mind two or three different like attack pattern rhythms. That's what's obnoxious about it, is having to like swap your muscle memory. Okay, he's gonna delay. Oh, now he's gonna be fast. It just, oh, now he's gonna saunter. It just, he's all over the place. It's so frustrating to keep up with all that. Remember, video games are fun. 
this is actually a very engaging boss, but goddamn is it annoying as shit to deal with. More fire. There we go. You know what? I'm not even gonna go for it. We're not gonna get greedy. Okay, I got greedy. Just the one time. And I think I just went here. Except I forgot I ran out of blue stuff! But I finished him off anyways. Remembrance of putrescence. 220 big fat smackaroos for my efforts. And a partridge on a pet tree. All right, I'll tickle some grace. Couple level ups. Let's go talk to Saint Trina. <sighs> we. Okay, so here's what happens when you try to. T oh, actually, first I want to read these messages because there's a there's a very specific way you have to interact with Saint Trina. Whoops. One second. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Circling around. Oh, circling around. Hmm. Why is it always lover? That's not exactly what's going on here. Not even remotely. So if we imbibe the nectar... Hmm. I bet it tastes like... Blueberries. Wait, it's purple. I'm a little colorblind. And we're knocked out. <laughs> you OD'd on the nectar. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, so it just, like, wrecks you for some reason. Well, St. Trina's all about putting you to sleep. I'm curious, is it one of those things where if I do it enough times, she just starts talking to me? Let me do it a second time. Maybe I just have to keep doing it, keep dying, and then she eventually, she's just like, tarnished. Okay, nap time. Time for death, but don't give up. Lover, it's not, trust me, that's, let there be, it's not a lover, it's, St. Trina and Mikola were basically the same person, and Mikola extracted St. Trina from his, like, demigod person. This is the result of that extraction. Similar concept of how Merica and Radagon are the same person, same deal, Mikola and St. Trina are the same person, or were the same person, until Mikola came to the Shadow Realm and severed St. Trina from, from his person. One more time, maybe third time's the charm. All right, it's time for the third nap. I really don't know what to do with St. Trina right now. I'm uh, kind of, I'm hypothesizing right now. <laughs> the runes are just right here. Hey, 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 just get the fuck out of here. All right, if I don't get any dialogue options, we're gonna check the cookbook that I picked up. Okay, yeah, it's, it's, I gotta do something specific. Oh, do I have to consume a lulling branch? I'm gonna consult the directory. One moment. Right, so, after consulting the directory, I have to do this six times. You basically, so you have to imbibe the nectar six times. So you have to kill yourself six times. Imbibe the nectar six times. I already said that. I apologize for the repetition. Hey, Terrence, you want a little sip as well? And nap time. That was the fourth sip. Okay, I see. 
the more you imbibe the nectar, the more you get to... So you can only speak to St. Trina while you're in your sleep. So she's, so she's like in a deep... Okay, l let me check something. I'm curious. So St. Trina. Okay, yeah, so she appears to be in some eternal sleep. So the only... Okay, that's why we have to imbibe the nectar. It's the only way to talk to her is by... Well, why do we have to do this like five, six times? I'm sure there's a lore reason behind it. Okay, okay, what, what, what else is there to say? Okay, and the plot thickens. Okay. Sixth time. Alright, so I only do it six times, but if... Does anything happen if I do it the seventh time? Or does she just repeat that same phrase beyond that? Okay, so she'll just keep repeating that. Got it. Okay, so now that I've exhausted St. Trina's dialogue, I have to consult the directory once more. Okay, I've consulted the directory. Fair viewers of Cato's Corner. Now. Okay, let's go talk to Theolier. But have I got great news for you. Let's go ahead and purchase this uh, perfume bottle. Oh, I already bought it. Cool. So, uh, I know where St. Trina is. Okay, and now... If we go back... Garden of Deep Purple. I'll just go ahead and rest here. Just to confirm... Sorry, it's the truth. But... Alright, now after resting, does she attack... Wait. Okay, here we go. Sorry I had to end this way. But, you know, it's the Shadow Realm. This, these things happen. And we acquired St. Trina's Smile. Well, I'm a little, I got some itchy balls right now. Let me just scratch it off at this side of grace. Yeah. Okay, let's check some stuff out here. It's a talisman. St. Trina's Smile. Sleep in the vicinity increases attack power. That seems pretty niche, but I'm glad I was able to get this. All right, we are now moving on to the storehouse first floor. All right, let's make our way. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Whoopsie doodles. We, 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 all the way home. We, we, get some chrome. Everything's chrome in the future. Yeah. Okay, I'm... I had to get that out of my system. We can now continue. Also, fuck these two tables in particular. Bolt Drake Talisman plus three. <gasps> Ooh. I think that's going to be extra special against Bale. Right. Crank that shaft. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, I can get through now. Back in my day. You little shit. Wait, wiggity, whoa, flurpy, slurpies. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. They're gonna go. Oh, it's these guys. Don't poison me. Hey guys, I learned this new dance move. I know, it's so hot, right? Bibbidi bobbidi boop. What's in the sploop? Fire coil. Well, I mean, sure, if it, if it just happens to be there. It's a hefty beast bone and. Hmm. Fine, I won't do this anymore. I will continue to move forward. 
Ow. Wait for it, and lobster. These slow guys hit pretty... These guys hit pretty rough. Life is a little rough when you... Wait, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. <laughs> right in the esophagus. Ooh. Slurpee, slurpee. Oh, beast horns. I can craft that one purple concoction. I'ma just go for it. God fucking damn it! Do these assholes never stagger? Alright, that's it. We're just gonna... I'm just gonna run past every... Wait, wait, hang on. Did I even go the right way? Well, this goes in a direction. So we gotta keep going this way. You missed. Don't worry, don't worry. I just... Listen, I'm intentionally ignoring you because I don't want to deal with any of your bullshit. It has nothing to do with you as folks. Just your bullshit. Okay, there we go. Wait for it, wait for it. Hold on, hold on, tickle my nuts and crinkle my fries. Get the fuck out of my rive. Yo, got the fire knight armor. Oh, it's you flurps. Yeah, I don't feel like dealing with your sass. And I almost got poisoned in the process. I am just going to give you the business. Fine. Ugh, fuck, I'm poisoned. But we do need to go up here. And now we gotta go up here. And up here. Sip. Jump. Scatter tree fragment. Hip, hip, hooray. Activate this grace. Take a little nap. Fantastic.